Game of the week, Rockbridge County trying to take another step in that rebuild by taking down the nemesis that is Spotswood. Now, Eric told us at six, Spotswood's playoff win back in 2017 over Rockbridge, something that's been bothering Coach Poston ever since. Tonight, a chance to see if they are ready to take the next step. Eric. Hey, Happy, that playoff loss has been bothering Coach Poston and the players, so therefore Rockbridge put a lot of weight on this game in regards to perhaps where they could stack up when the playoffs do come around. With that being said, they knew they would have to play a near-perfect game in order to get a win tonight against Spotswood. Let's get you out to the action. Picturesque night, full moon on tap. Opening drive for the Wildcats was a success. Gage Schaefer found some running room on the edges that led to a Rockbridge field goal. Spotswood responded with a touchdown, and then their defense helped out. John Van Huss with the interception and that led to another trailblazer touchdown, 14-3 lead. Later in the second quarter after a turnover on downs, check out Ryan High rolling out, throwing it high to Robert Smith, 32-yard touchdown just before halftime, 35-3 was the score. Spots was scored on every possession in the first half. Fans were kept quiet for much of this one. Wildcats looking for momentum. They tackle the punter after the botched punt. That's Mr. Nicely on the play there. Rockbridge would cash in. Brett McClung rushes to the edge for the late touchdowns to end the third quarter. But Spotswood would never let up, and they showed why they are tied for first in Region 3C after a 55-10 win. Got to give them all the credit. They were they're they're a very good football team. Mm -hmm. um, no, they just beat us in every face tonight. There's no excuses. They they come down and flat out beat us. We got to get better. You know, we just go back to work Monday and try to get better. I mean, it's just a process. You just got to keep working. Rockbridge was clearly taken out of this game really early in this one as uh, Spotswood really went on to take advantage of turnovers and they scored on each and every possession in that first half, as we mentioned. Of course, it's a tough loss for Rockbridge, a team that's been perhaps trying to turn the page and really complete the rebuild for this program under Coach Poston. But this is one of those losses you can definitely learn from and take advantage of as you move on.